check the mic and make sure it sound right, boys. I'm Chaplain Road Short. With an increase of sightings of UFOs in the last few years, it's opened up conversations of aliens from other galaxies. Maybe here to save our world, become a better place, stop wars and global conflicts, a new hope for humanity. As Christians, we understand there is only one hope, and that's in Jesus Christ. We also are warned in the Bible in Exodus 20, 03, you should have no other God before me. If these aliens did solve our world problems, wouldn't we as humans lean toward worshiping them as we do our pop culture heroes of today? And with pop culture, wouldn't an alien from another planet open up a new conversation about fairness, equality, social justice? Maybe minorities around the world would have their platforms lowered to give attention to a whole new culture of people with a different opinion on what's right and what's wrong in this world today. Who knows what an alien would say about the turmoil today? A lot of people feel it would be good to have these aliens come to our planet. Or some think it might look a little like this short take. Hello and welcome to Cocker Tarlson. Tonight we continue our series on race. Unlike Republican white supremacists who don't think skin color should be an issue, at CNN we're going to uncover some uncomfortable truths about skin color. Because race is important. Skin color is important. In fact, it should be discussed, dissected, and examined 24 hours a day. If we don't obsess over skin color, we'll never eradicate the systemic racism that permeates every fiber of this despicable country we live in. Tonight's guest is Mott Elsinou, an alien American who's here to set us straight on what it's like to live as an alien American in an oppressive, racist country like America. Hi, Mott. Thanks for coming on. Thanks for having me on. Let's get right to it. How much does it suck? Well, the food in the green room, um, the bagels are kind of stale. No. How much does it suck living in a racist country? I don't live in it. Yes, you do. What is your earliest memory of the systemic racism that defines America? I don't know. Right now? On this show? Oh, so you're saying as an alien American, you never... Well, we came here from Mars. I was very, very young, and my father brought us here for a better life, and we got one. And it wasn't always that easy. Let's talk about that. About what? The bad stuff. There's always going to be racism because there's always going to be ignorant people. But I don't define myself or live my life based on what somebody else thinks. That's a really unhealthy attitude. Tuck, you're sitting here bashing middle America, but look at all your Hollywood pals. I mean, the green stereotypes they perpetrate on TV and in the movies, the Wicked Witch, Shrek, and you know, Gumby. Gumby, okay? And what's up with the, the, the Mr. Woke Jim Carrey? Okay, the mask, the Grinch. Yeah, I, I think he was a Republican when he made those. So what do you want me to do? You want me to run around and tear statues down to E.T., burn William Shatner bobbleheads? What do you want me to do? I'm an ally. I don't even it, know what you're doing it, right now. I don't... Is, what, what is that? See, this is do you think global about. warming contributed to the Area 51 crash? The Martian driving hammered. I think that had something to do with the Area 51 crash. You are a terrible guest. Thanks for coming on. Well, you're a terrible host. And your bagels stink. Well, that wraps up for tonight. Thank you for joining us. But don't go anywhere. Joe Woken's coming up, and he is a very special guest. I'll give you a hint. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> Not talking about a rapper. Okay. Hey, it's your old friend, Chaplin Road Short from Short Takes and the Chaplin TV series. Now you can catch us, if you have a Roku channel, uh, on your television set 
under the Crux channel. So check us out. Check us out on the Crux channel on Roku and uh, still check us out here at YouTube uh, at Crux TV and Short Takes and the Chaplin TV series. If you like the content we're doing, please like, subscribe and share to this channel and we'll definitely make more. Thanks again. See you next time.